All right, two things about this new node project I'm about to introduce to y'all. $120 for one node, 5% a day. Is it a move? Let's find out. What's going on everybody, it's Kolev. I hope you're having a great day or night, whatever time you are watching this video. Now this is going to be a relatively new node project. This project came out around the 7th of March. So it is very early to get into this project. Good old Diego uh, once again came through and I actually bought some a while ago when it launched and I was able to get some in around $3 and currently we are still at double that price at six but it did skyrocket all the way up to 12 which is pretty awesome what else is awesome is that drastic nodes actually did reach out to me to sponsor this video which is pretty cool because i was getting ready to make a video about them so it kind of lined up perfectly so thank you Jurassic knows for sponsoring this video and guys if y'all do enjoy this video please leave me a sub down below and a like if you really do enjoy it now let's dive deep into the project all right guys so the website is going to be jurassicnodes.com again jurassicnodes.com do not go to any other website do not get scammed i tell y'all every video don't do it all right so gain passive income by leveraging jurassic's financial protocol as you see they have the jurassic park theme kind of going it is, it is very nice whoever did the art you know it, it, it's actually really cool because they actually did put time a lot of these node projects you know they, they may reuse assets or there's not really really anything inspiring you know about the art one thing i will say is that this project definitely did uh, you know hire somebody to create the artwork for the project so it's very very nice jurassic nodes is a new protocol in the avalanche ecosystem the price of a node is 20 dino with daily rewards of one dino or five percent a day keep in mind if the price of the token doubles after creation you will only need 10 days instead of 20 days to make your investment back the creation of nodes will allow you to get passive income for life and i'm just going to say that life means the life of the project it just makes me look at that terminology better. So yeah, so with this project right now at a 5% per day rate, you are looking at a 20 day ROI. Obviously, like they said, if the coin doubles, then that will cut that in half and you know so on and so forth. Like I said, when I first bought the token, it was at $3, but the token did launch at one cent. So everybody that got in very early, y'all are some lucky dogs. It, it had the typical you know crypto project, shot up really hard went down but had a very strong growth upward and you know it's still in a way trending upward so like i said this could be a really good time I'm not a financial advisor nothing in this video is financial advice but if you were to get into another node project i know a lot of node projects are down right now this would probably be your best bet it's currently what i'm doing and uh, i do i do plan on making a video later on going over my top paying node projects how much i'm making per month so if y'all are interested in that video, leave me a like down below and leave me a comment letting me know that as well. All right, so back here on the website, we have a couple more options. We got dashboard, uh, however you say this dinosaur eggs, T-Rex eggs, buy dino, chart, and white paper. So if we go over to the dashboard, it's going to take us to our analytic page. As you can see, I do have five eggs already. I have earned about 13.44 dino rewards and there's a total of 6,002 eggs where a majority of them are the regular egg and 159 of them are the T-Rex egg. I'll get into the differences between them because they can be fairly different, but we'll go ahead and dive in to see if it's something that may be worth it to you. But clicking on the dip eggs, that's just what I'm going to call it it's going to be your essentially dashboard for the node because that's essentially what this is right it's a it's a node project um and this is going to be the dashboard for this type of node as you see again how there are this there are 5843 of these nodes i have currently five and my rewards are 13.45 dino I can claim them, but I have not touched this since I bought in at $3 and I don't plan on it for a while unless I reinvest that back into the project. Another really cool part about this project that not a lot of node projects have 
is that they actually do have a referral system, which is pretty awesome. So if you did want to help me out or the channel, I would greatly appreciate it if y'all did use that referral link. It'll be down in the description at the top. Thank you if you use that referral link. Down here is going to be how you create an egg. I'm actually going to create two more eggs in this video. So you'll see that process. And at the bottom, you'll see my five dip eggs. That's, again, that's what I'm calling it. And the first one is Dino, Billy, Rexer, Lizard, and Dragon. Very unenthusiastic names, I know, but that's all I got. Now for the T-Rex eggs, you get a very loud noise, but it's uh, going, going to be the same type of interface. There are 160 currently at the time, but it's pretty much the same thing. The difference is that it's going to cost 20 dip eggs and 20 dino tokens. The other thing is that there's a condition in order to get this. You have to hold at least 40 dino, but your daily rewards are going to be 20 dino. So it's definitely really, really solid, but it also does give you another benefit that we will get into in the white paper. So don't leave yet. So the next option we have is to buy Dino. They have a link that takes you straight to Trader Joe. This is a project on the Avalanche blockchain and it's going to automatically populate their address. Again, this is basically just saying, hey, anyone could create a ERC20 token. It could be a scam. Are you sure this is the right address? Yes, we know it's the right address. We went to the correct website and we clicked the correct link. So we know that this address is, uh, it does give you an option to view it on Snowtrace if you want to verify that. So we're not gonna buy the dyno yet. We're gonna come back to this toward the end. Let's go ahead and go back to the website. All right, now that we're back on the website, let's quickly just look at the chart so I kind of show you what's going on here. So this is gonna be the chart. As you can see, if I go down here at the very bottom, we can see that it did launch at around one cent or at one cent and immediately within the first 30 minutes, shot up to $3.65, then shot back down to 96 cents, just about, and has pretty much went on an upward trajectory up until its peak at around $12.50. And now it's currently half that price at 633. So still a pretty solid entry point if you were interested in getting into this project. Like I said, I'm going to buy a couple more eggs in this video. I do think that this project definitely does have potential and the four devs of this project definitely seem like they know what they're doing and are very active on their Discord, which I always see as a really good sign of a product's longevity. All right, so going back here at the website, we're going to the last option here on this row. The other options we have down here are the white paper again, Discord and Twitter. So one really cool thing about this project is they actually have two different white papers. One of them is an awesome art illustration white paper. It goes over all the same information, but the other one is a more professional white paper. So we are going to take a look at both of them because I think the art style is very, very awesome, very, very unique. They definitely took the twist off of Jurassic and made it into its own thing, which again is really cool. I mean, if you're in this project to make money, that probably doesn't mean much to you. But I think it does mean a lot for some people because that shows that they are putting money into being unique instead of you know just a clone of another project which is pretty important so if you want to go to the professional version of their white paper both are professional but if you want to go to the uh, simple text basically version of the white paper it's going to be the one at the bottom and we'll quickly go over this right here we created this git book to summarize our white paper you will find all important information about the launch the price of the node is 20 dino with daily rewards of one dino or five percent a day keep in mind if the price of the token doubles after its creation you will only need 10 days of the 20 to get your investment back. Their vision and values, pretty important. So let's read this. Our main goal is to create a system that has a perfect balance between rewards and price stability for sustainable tokenomics. To do so, we have studied different node projects that have launched in the past months to get a maximum information and knowledge on it. The observation is clear. Taxes needed to be installed to reduce the selling pressure. These taxes will enable the protocol to gather funds for the LP, the reward pool, and the treasury. This makes the entire system more sustainable in the long run and encourages users to create nodes to enjoy lifetime returns rather than pump and dump on the token. A long-term vision is key to a node protocol success. 
very very well put but obviously we need to see them execute some of the some of this ideology you know before we can just believe that at face value right so there's two different types of nodes as we went over the dip eggs the dip eggs which nets you 20 dino which is five percent in return and the t-rex egg and now this is where it gets a little bit spicy the t-rex egg you know requires 20 dip eggs and 20 dino for a daily return of five percent so the same thing but except you have to understand so what's the difference the claim tax is going to be 15 percent so anytime you, know, you claim rewards you're going to get hit with a 15 percent tax which you may sound like a lot but if you invest properly and you hit your roi remember everything after your roi period is is profit it doesn't matter the 15 percent is important for longevity of the project so that that money is getting funneled back into the lp back into the reward pool to keep the project sustainable that t-rex node is going to drop that to 10 percent so it's still going to be enough to keep the project sustainable from that perspective but now you're gaining an extra five percent so in the long run yes it's going to make you a lot more money you just have to know if financially you're going to be able to work up enough to get 20 dip eggs in order to put that into a t-rex egg because again that's going to be a lot of money 20 dip eggs as well as 20 dino that can add up so if you truly do believe in the project i think the t-rex egg for sure is your best bet now probably one of the other most important things about a node project is understanding how they are allocating these tokens so as typical of most node projects 70 percent just about is going to go to the reward pool. The reward pool is the pool of tokens that are paid out to holders, and that's how the project mainly survives. Until the project can gain enough in their treasury to make other investments like validator nodes or investments into other projects through staking. We see that 250,000 Dino tokens are getting put into the liquidity pool, which is pretty important. And the, the team is taking a small amount of 50,000 dino for themselves. So again, in my opinion, you don't want to join a project where the team is taking, you know, 30 plus percent. If it's a project like this, like a node project where that's going to be a static value and the team is always going to get that. You don't want to join projects like that because then it essentially ends up just being a cash grab at that point. So a pretty low amount like this, I think is a very healthy and a pretty good indicator that the project can be legit. Uh, one other thing to note down here is that 50,000 tokens for the team, no token sell for the first 21 days, then possibly, then possibly to sell if the liquidity pool and the price of the token is suitable, maximum sell of 2,000 tokens per day per member. So that's pretty nice that they do have that set for their team and it's good to understand. Now, again, this isn't like most typical node projects to just have a claim tax or a sell fee. They're, they have a lot of things implemented to try to keep the price up and keep the project sustainable. So you really do have to understand everything in this project. The sell tax is another pretty important thing. So it's going to be a 20% sell tax on the first day, a 15% sell tax on the second day, a 10% sell tax on the third day, and then a 5% minimum. So this will help with some sort of longevity as far as Wells can't just dump in, you know, tens of thousands of dollars, pull out immediately. They are going to at least get taxed on that if they try to do such. And like they say in their white paper right here, the regressive tax will reduce the number of bots and quick flippers in the first days. We want to focus on the smartest guys that will create the nodes and enjoy passive income for life, life of the project. All right, so here's the launch details. I was slightly wrong. I thought it was a cent that the, pro that the project launched on, but it was actually four cents. So I apologize with that one. But the max buy is 1,250 dino and the max wallet can have a total of 3,750 dino. The transfer tax will be 40%. Again, very important. Y'all may see that as a crazy number. Why is there 40% a transfer tax? Guys, bots and whales. It's super, it's, it's very important. I, I don't think necessarily this is really for the whales. I think that mainly bots, because you have to understand that bots can, can transact things in, in seconds, right? They can execute all these things in seconds. So they can easily, you know, uh, buy the tokens up, dump them, and they transfer so that it's hard to track things. So having a 40% transfer tax is awesome because they, if bots do come in and try to buy up all the tokens, then the tax is pretty much just gonna bring all that money back to the project, which I think is a very smart move and projects need to have something like this, guys. You have to have some sort of bot defense mechanism, whatever you wanna call it, and I think that this is one really good way to do it.
And finally, the last part of their white paper is things that is coming soon to the project. They want a test net. The first three things are confirmed and done. Uh, the next is going to be audit on the contracts listing on coin market cap and coin gecko. They have listed on coin uh, coin gecko earlier today, which is pretty awesome. They want to do a more aggressive marketing campaign, Twitter, YouTube, Instagram, etc. Partnerships with other projects, frequent updates of the website, and of course the referral link, which is available now. All right, so now we're back on the main website, and I'm just gonna briefly go over the other white paper. This this thing is awesome, y'all. Whole art style, the whole thing is 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 arted out of its mind. It essentially goes over the same thing, but obviously in a different manner. This can, I guess you can say, make it a little bit harder to read. That's why I went ahead and went over the text version. But I think it's definitely another good read to read it like this. They say everything that they say in the other white paper, but they say it here in a different way. And I think it's pretty, pretty awesome. Yeah, very, very, very cool art style. That you know, they definitely took some sort of time to do all this. I, th I, th I think it's, I think it's really, really cool. All right, right here again is going to be the team. So we have two Solidity devs. It's going to be Gecko and Trice. Have a front end dev, which is very important. You need to have a front end dev. You want your website to look uh, the most unique as possible, the most professional as possible. So pretty important. Young Stem is going to be that guy. The advisor is going to be Rex. The community manager is going to be Raptor. And the designer, which I think would be the artist in this case, is going to be Vector. I don't know that for certain. That's just what I'm guessing. But those are going to be your six team members for this project. We would like to remain anonymous because for us, it is very core to DeFi, which that is relatively true. We are 100% transparent with our community and available to answer all your questions in Discord. And I can confirm that they are in there. We will catch at least one of them, mainly at least two of them in there. All right, so now we're back on the website. Let's go ahead and buy some more Dino and get a couple more eggs. So again, it's going to be 20 dino for one egg. So we're going to accept that. All right, do have a couple of dino already. Let's see what, what we need for that. Do 3.5. Going to do 3.3. Yeah, we can do 3.9. You know, it would do 3.2, even better. All right, so 3.2. That should get us a total of 40 dino, which is going to be two eggs. Another thing again, guys, if y'all don't do this, please do this. Change your slippage to 0.01. It says your transaction may fail, but guys, it doesn't happen very often. All right, and now we are, all right, the transaction is approved. Now let's just wait for our balance to reflect it. All right, there we go. It says it's confirmed right there. Still don't see it here yet, but got to give it some more time. All right, so I just had to refresh the page and then it updated. So we're gonna go back to the website. All right, and we're gonna make two more eggs. I don't know what to call them. Let's see. Um, we're gonna call this one Drac. Oh, and another thing with the names, do not do any, any special characters or anything, because again, that could mess up the contract. I'm not saying it's gonna mess this one up, but I know in other node projects, it has done that. And also with this node project, the name needs to be at least four characters long. And then we're just going to call this one Pika like Pikachu. Making money is great, but sometimes you got to have a little fun. All right. And there we go. We got our node down there. And that is simply how you create a node. All right, guys. So that is going to be Jurassic Nodes, a very unique website. There's nothing really like it. There's nothing that looks like it. I don't think there's any node project that has an art style that's this in depth like this one. It's, it's very cool, a very, very cool concept. Again, it's still a node project at the end of the day, but this is going to be one of the latest ones that are out and one of the ones that it seems like the devs actually did put time into, at least on the front end. The link to their Discord is also going to be down in the description. So also make sure you go there, check it out. Let them know I sent you if you end up going. And again, if y'all did want to use my referral link for this project, that will also be down in the description. Guys, thank you so much for being here. Thanks for hanging out. It is always a good time to be here. And like always, guys, have a great day or night, whatever time you are watching this video. 